You know, I didn't think I'd ever need a trailer. And after talking to several people in the club that have one, and after getting bigger planes, and after getting tired of taking everything up and down the stairs every time I wanted to fly it, and after not being able to take everything I wanted to take, this winter I had this trailer built. This is a H and H trailer made in Clarinda, Iowa. We're in Missouri right now. I want to just give you a little walk around the trailer here. Good day. I'm Dick Gibson, and this is my trailer. Okay, it is a 12 by 6 trailer with a V nose a little bit of a V on the top and a round top. This really makes for a very aerodynamic trailer. Very, you really don't even know it's behind this van. I had larger vents put in it that open either way. It opens this way or it opens back. Okay? I had the deck plate extended all the way around and I contacted Flex and they told me I could use the picture of their 170 on the side of my trailer. It has LED lighting and what I did here was I had instead of leaf springs, I talked to a lot of people and they suggested torsion bar springs, torsion bars. It's very smooth and basically is independent suspension on each side. These are neat little marker lights. They're on all trailers, but it really helps you see the fenders at night. Okay, come on around this way. I had, with a suggestion of some people, I had legs, leveling legs put in the bottom and they just it won't go down now because I have to let the front of the trailer down and let it put them in but when you, sometimes you might be necessary to disconnect your car from the trailer at a big event this lets it be very stable inside and there's no way to tip on the back I had barn doors put on instead of a ramp They really finish the inside of the doors off nice with a sheet of aluminum. I've chosen to mount most of my airplanes on the wall. And they ride pretty good except for this one. And I even experimented with a shelf at one time, but for me the shelf didn't work. I like to be able to walk through the trailer and get to the planes on the wall. And this is all I need to fly. And most of them are foam so they don't weigh anything. And it just works out better for me. If I wanted to put the shelf back in, I could have used this Z-Track to do it and it's real handy. When, before we even set foot in the trailer, we painted the sides with two coats of a high quality enamel, latex enamel. Did the walls and the floors, painted them. And then we got some carpet at the uh, home improvement store and put on. And then a piece of trim to, to trim out the edge of the carpet and I did the same trim on the walk-in door. stays very cool in the summertime, especially with those vents open. Okay, let's go back around to the side here. We got a lot of parts for this trailer on E-Trailer. It's a place in St. Louis that does online trailer stuff and now you can find anything. 
I was looking for a really good step, found this in there. This is rated for 10,000 pounds, can you believe it? It's adjustable, you can set it for uneven ground. Okay, inside, come on in. Inside, I used a bathroom cabinet here and a piece of plywood. Made me a little shelf. I wired it for 110. I've got a little generator I can plug into it on the front. And there's another plug in the back. Haven't really needed it because I'll show you later why. Uh, we're green. We're using solar power to, to run this trailer. So, and I have an inverter down here. We'll talk about that later, but here's... Well, I can't show this vent right now. But, it makes it really nice inside. Uh, and then really, really light when I turn the lights on. I used uh, three strings of LED lights, 15 foot lights. Wired them right into the battery. So this is my trailer, and as a side note, this winter I put a, started a, a um, thing on Facebook, show me your trailer, and I had dozens of people show me their trailer and give me suggestions. And I want to thank people from all over the country on what to do and how to do it. I researched it before I did anything and pretty much are using uh, all these ideas in this trailer. So if this makes a great model airplane hauling trailer, it's uh, easy to pull, easy on gas, and easy to hook up. So I love it. My airplane hauler.